Hi, I'm Michael. I've been playing the piano for more than 20 years. And today you are going to find out exactly how musically gifted you are on a scale from 0 to 15. But first, grab a piece of paper and a pen or pencil. And here's everything you need to know before we start this test. This test contains 15 questions. Each question gets progressively more difficult. Each question will have two or three answers, but only one answer will be the correct one. You will get about 10 seconds after each question to think and write down your answer. Feel free to pause and replay each question before answering. I will provide the correct answers after each question and at the end of the video so that you can tally your final score. Are you ready to start? Here we go. Question number one. You will hear two notes played one after the other. Is the second note A higher or B lower than the first note? The correct answer is A higher. Question number two. Just like the previous question, you will again hear two notes played one after the other. Is the second note A lower or B the same? The correct answer is B the same. Question number three. Once again, you will hear two notes played one after the other. Is the second note A higher, B lower, or C the same? The correct answer is B, lower. Question number four. You will hear two notes separated by a five second gap. Are these notes A, the same, or B, different? The correct answer is B, different. Question number five. Once again, you will hear two notes separated by a five second gap. Are these notes A, the same, or B, different? The correct answer is A, the same. Question number six. You will hear a chord followed by a single note. Does this note A fit together with the chord? Or B clashes with it? The correct answer is A, it fits together. Question number seven. You will hear another chord followed by a single note. Does this note A fit together or B clashes with the chord? The correct answer is B, it clashes. Question number eight. 
This time, you will hear a scale followed by a single note. Does this note fit together with the scale? Or B, clashes with the scale? The correct answer is A, fit together. Question number nine. You will hear a chord followed by a short melody. Does this melody A, fit together or B, clashes? The correct answer is B. It clashes with the chord. Question number 10. Same as before, you will hear a chord followed by another short melody. Does this melody A. fit together or B. clashes with the chord? The correct answer is A. Fit together. Question number 11. There are two main types of tonalities in Western music, major and minor. Major scales and chords sound open and bright, and they are used to convey happy emotions. On the other hand, minor scales and chords sound closed and dark, and they are used to convey sad emotions. For this example, you will first hear a chord followed by a short melody in the same tonality. Does this example sound A. Major and happy or B. Minor and sad? The correct answer is B, minor or sad. Question number 12. Same as before, you will first hear a chord followed by a short melody in the same tonality. Does this example sound A, major and happy, or B, minor and sad? The correct answer is A, major and happy. Every musical phrase or melody contains a dissonance and a consonance or a resolution. You can think of it as tension and release, or a question and an answer. In this example, you will first hear a chord followed by a short melody. Does this melody sound A. Resolved, like an answer, or B. Unresolved, like a question? The correct answer is A. Resolved like an answer. Question 14. Similarly, you will first hear a chord followed by a short musical phrase. Does this melody sound A. Resolved like an answer? Or B. Unresolved like a question?
The correct answer is B, unresolved. And finally, the last question. You will hear seven consecutive ascending notes followed by one single note after a five second pause. There's a chance this last note could be a repetition of one of the seven consecutive notes. Is the last note A, repeat it, or B, not repeat it? The correct answer is A. Repeat it. Thank you for taking this test. I'm sure you found it interesting. Feel free to share your results in the comment section below. I would love to know the questions that were difficult for you. If you think that this test was valuable to you, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And once again, here's all the correct answers for you.